Hey, Clarence, we have a question that's come into Loveology, and it's a personal one. And this guy is saying, I know my wife enjoys sex, but I don't think she wants to have sex with me. Yikes. <laughs> what do you have to say about that? Well, I'll say a couple of things. One, it's good that she want, that she enjoys sex with you. That's good, because if yeah. she wasn't, that could be a problem. Yeah. But she may not want to have sex with you because maybe she feels that for her, she's not that important to you. And our wives are really into relationships. And so maybe you stop dating her and maybe the only time you touch her is when you have sex is that that makes her feel like a piece of meat. And so, she, you know, she really wants you to want to be with her. And I heard Melanie Fleming, who was who co-authored a book called The Dance of Restoration, uh, Overcoming Marital Infidelity. And, and what she said was it's much riskier for women to have sex with men than for men to have sex with women. And what she meant by that is that most women, not necessarily all women, have to open themselves up emotionally to us before they can open themselves up physically. And so if you're not paying attention to that, that may be why she enjoys sex, but doesn't necessarily want to have sex with you right now or as frequently as you would like to have it. Yeah. And I, I think this is so wise because we so often feel like if you're getting rejected by your, your wife, in this case, uh, to have sex, that it's, oh, well, it's just, it's me. She doesn't like me and how I perform or whatever. It's not that necessarily at all. It's that, no, you're not cultivating the sex. Exactly. And as other people have said here at Loveology and other videos, uh, we all need to be reminded, sex is not just relegated to the bedroom. Sex sometimes begins in the kitchen, in the living room, in the garage, because you're cultivating the relationship for the sex that you eventually do have in the bedroom. Isn't that right? Exactly. You know, like if you're having problems in the bedrooms, because you're having problems outside the bedroom. Yeah. And so yeah. she wants to be the most important thing in your life. Or as a Christian woman, maybe the second thing, God first, and then she comes second. And if she doesn't feel that way, then it can translate of not wanting to feel close or not feeling close with you. Yeah. Uh, another thing I'm hearing from a lot of women that I counsel with their husbands is that they don't always feel safe. Mm -hmm. And so they want to feel safe with you. Yeah. And being safe is how you treat them, how you talk to them. Uh, all that's really important. Yeah. Uh, I tell yeah. guys, you know, hey, you know, why don't you text your wife during the day to say, I love you or I'm thinking about you? Yeah. And how does that take for you to text? Maybe two seconds. Right. If you do that a couple times a day, that's going to make her feel really good about you, that you're thinking about her, not just when she's in your presence. Yeah. Creating that emotional safe zone. So Clarence, yeah. very helpful information as always here at Loveology. Thank you.